They say they want to stand here for 4,259 seconds, which represents the number of service people killed over the last six years. That translates, that 4,259 seconds translates to 70 minutes or an hour and 10 minutes. They have been asked by the San Francisco police to leave twice or risk arrest. No one has budged, so presumably they are going to be removed here one way or another sometime soon. Earlier today, another group also blocked traffic on Market Street, angry that while Iraq might be winding down, thousands of troops are going to be pouring into Afghanistan. We are having a moment of silence for every service member killed in Iraq. If we were to do every civilian killed in Iraq, we would be here for two weeks. We want to hold this space for 71 minutes. Once that time is over, we are going to leave. We're asking one second. This is Captain McDonough of the San Francisco Police That's Department. All we're asking for if one second clear, for every life. Service people who have served since September 11, 2001. They call themselves Iraq Veterans Against the War, and they're here to protest um, the continuance of the Iraq War and also the war in Afghanistan. These are Iraq Veterans Against the War holding a moment of silence for all of those killed in Iraq. They are having one second of silence for each U.S. troop who has lost his or her life in Iraq, totaling 71 minutes. It has only been 40 minutes up to this point. Mercenaries for hire. You sit back and watch. Sit on the watch, never mind the cause. The death count is high. And the death count is high. You lie in your mansion. Well, I ain't 